Tonight is the Spring City Halloween Festival. That means we only have a day to build everything. So, listen up, team. Over here, we'll build a barbecue where guests can get their food. At the back, we'll build a trick-or-treat trail. Behind you, we're going to build an entrance shaped like a pumpkin. And finally... <sighs> and finally what? Floating above the party, there will be a giant ghost decoration. Ew. Can we build it? Yes, yes we, we can! can. Ew. Ah, oh, Lofty, there you are. Ew. I need you to collect the ghost decoration from Curtis. Are you sure it has to be me? Your crane is perfect for holding it. Well, uh, yes. OK. The ghost is all ready to self-inflate. You pull a cord first, then it fills with air. So be careful not to knock the crate. Boy. Sudden movement will trigger the cord. So the ghost could fill with air when you don't want it to. Here it goes. I'm scared already. Let's get this ghost delivered and quick. Who's there? I'm not scared, I'm not scared, I'm not scared. Wah! This entrance is going to be cool. Ah! Whoa. Ah! Wah! What's that? A ghost! This is all my fault. <gasps> I can help! <sighs> well done, Lofty. I'm really sorry, Bob. I shouldn't have dropped the ghost like that, only I was scared. I've attached new wires so the ghost can stay here until we're ready for it. We'd better get fixing. Well, we're all finished. Whoa. Oh, 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 ah, guys, hold on, there's a ghost. <laughs> we tricked Bob. <laughs> right. <laughs> right, I better stop because I just scared myself. Could you build that new shower block next to these bedrooms, please, Bob? No problem. I've already drawn up some plans. This looks amazing, Bob. OK, team. Can we build it? Yes, yes we, we can! can. Here we are, then. Out you get, Spring City Rockets. Hi, Brandon. Who's my favourite nephew? We can't wait for tonight. Uncle Phil so we could camp out. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'd forgotten I'm taking your Auntie Val out for dinner, Brandon. You'll have to do it another time when I'm here. Aww. What if I looked after them? Please, Uncle Phil. OK. <laughs> I'd love to try camping. Sleep in the girls' tent with us tonight, then, Dizzy. Let's make sure there are no insects in the tent this time, Mila. Insects? Oh. I don't really like creepy crawlies. Last time, Safi found an earwig in her sleeping bag. Maybe I'll camp with you another time. I wish I was camping with the others. But I really don't like creepy crawlies. But maybe they've got them all out of the tent by now. Ditty, it's too late now. What if we both go now? Hey, you're not going without me. But what nobody knew is that something strange lurked in the woods. Ooh. It had eyes so big and bright they could blind you. <gasps> the creature! Ah! Everyone get into Betsy! We're going home. Where is Dizzy? I thought she was behind you. 
We have to go back and look for her. We're not on our own. It's too scary. We'll have to wake Bob up. <gasps> we didn't realise you weren't with us until we got back to the yard. Are you okay, Dizzy? I'm fine. Huh? <gasps> How did all that happen? That might have been us, Bob. I think we're going to have to come back very early tomorrow. Sorry, Bob. Sorry. We're really sorry about the mess, Mr Lucas. We'll put everything right. You'll see. This looks amazing, Bob. Thank you all for finishing on time. What's that on the roof, Bob? It's called a solar panel, Lofty. It turns sunlight into electricity. We must think ahead and build more renewable energy for all of Spring City. What's that? Renewable energy, Muck. It's electricity made from things that won't run out, like sunlight. Oh. And our job at the Sea Life Centre is to install another type of renewable energy. They're wind turbines. They make electricity from the power of the wind. Amazing. Oh, I'm looking forward to turning them on, Bob. Then we'd better get going. How's it going, Wendy? Everything's on schedule for the mayor to make the big switch over this evening. Great. OK, team. Can we build them? Yes, we can! Bob, we must talk about the Mayor's other renewable energy plans. Thinking ahead, that's the motto. It's just the... Yes, I don't just want to tell you the Mayor's plans, Bob. I want to show you. OK. You're in charge, Scoop. No problem, Bob. Hmm. I wonder... What is it, Scoop? What if we move the foundations closer together? Ew, I'm not sure you want to do that. That's not what Bob said. But we could get ten spinny turbines into the same space. Uh... And remember, Mr Bentley said we should think ahead. <laughs> Wendy's nearly finished connecting the... Are those foundations closer together? Yes, it's like Mr Bentley said. We're thinking ahead. Oh. OK, Lofty. Steady. Brilliant! Bob, look! We've been thinking ahead. Hang on a moment. They're too close together. <gasps> oh, no! I broke the spinny things. Scoop. Oh, Bob. I wanted to make room for more spinny turbines in the future, so I got Lofty to move the foundations closer together. I'm so sorry, Bob. All right. We need a new plan, Bob. If only we could use sun power instead of just spinny wind power. Brilliant. That gives me an idea. Come on, team. Look at the shiny solar panels. Wonderful! Right, team. Today, we are going to be finishing the lift for the skyscraper. Brilliant! When you've got a building as tall as this, it's far too high to get up and down using the stairs. So, we build a little carriage called a lift that you get into, press a button, and it will take you all the way to the top. Wow! I want to see the whole of Spring City. Can I go up in the lift? Please, 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 please! Sorry, Scoop. I think you're just a little bit too big to go up in a lift. Can we build it? Yes, we can! Can you send the loading cage down again, please? Time for some tower power! What are you doing, Scoop? I'm going to see the whole of Spring City! I'm going up! I'm going up! I'm still going up! Oh, no! <laughs> 
know. But this is higher than I thought. That sounds like Scoop. Whoa! 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 Oh no! I'm balancing! I've got an idea. Slow down and stop. Perfect. Scoop, I need you to roll carefully towards me. Don't look down. You're doing great. Hold it steady, Tiny. Well done. What on earth were you doing up there, Scoop? I'm sorry, everyone. I just really wanted to go up in a lift and see the whole of Spring City. Well, at least you're OK. Right. If we all work together, we might still get the job done in time. There. All done. At least you got to see the whole of Spring City, Scoop. I did. But I think this digger will be keeping his wheels firmly on the ground from now on. Right, team. Today, we're going to be finishing off the new giraffe enclosure. I love giraffes. They're my favourite animal because their necks are really, really long. Just like my Jeb. They are. That's great, Lofty. Now, you have to lift all our building supplies over the zoo fence. Right, Bob. And the rest of us will be inside finishing the giraffe enclosure. <gasps> oh, no. This fence is really high. I'll never be able to see the giraffe over that. Can we build it? Yes, we can. There. This should keep the giraffe safely in his home. Look, Lofty, it's the giraffe. Wait there, Lofty. I'd better see if Bob needs my help to get him in. Oh, I can't see it. If I can just peek through. Lofty. I'm really sorry, Bob. Wendy and Leo, can you repair the fences and the viewing platform and scoop? Can you help them? Okay, okay Bob. Bob. And the rest of us will split up and find the giraffe. sign of him anywhere. The poor thing. He hasn't even had his lunch yet. <gasps> if it's the giraffe's lunch time, he might come out if he sees some food. Good idea, Lofty. <gasps> oh, hello, Mr. Giraffe. It's working, Lofty. I don't know. What about Lofty the giraffe? After Lofty the crane who helped find him. Fantastic! Scoop's a nice name too, you know. 